what's going on youtube before we go any further smash that like button hit that subscribe button tap that little notification bell you'll get notified every time i drop a video if you like content like this if you want to continue to support the channel there goes the cash app if you're blessed enough to bless the channel it will all go to growing the channel even further man i appreciate every single one of y'all let's go what's in it, youtube look man another wild situation another wild story this this is on a more serious note, man. A more serious note in the city of Stockton, California, Northern Cali. There's a there's a situation at hand. There's a situation going on. I don't know if you guys heard about it yet, or if you guys you know from the surrounding area, you may have heard about it. But there's a serial killer on the loose, and I ain't talking about a person that goes in and eats all your cereal. You know what I'm saying? That be taking all your lucky charms, taking all, eating up all the Cheerios. Nah, not that cereal. 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 You know what I'm saying? I don't know if y'all can tell, say, you know what I'm saying? Because of my accent, if you feel me, you, you can't tell the difference in my words. But it's real. I'm going to let y'all hear this clip right now. It's from a uh, respectable news outlet within the 209 area. And um, this is the head director of this news outlet. Listen to what he has to say. However, due to the severity of events that have transpired recently in our city, I find it necessary to communicate directly with our audience. I want to address the article that was put out yesterday by 209 Times in regards to the possibility of a serial killer operating in our city. Regardless of what mainstream media is saying and regardless of what Chief McFadden said during his press conference, I am here to let you know and confirm that in fact, Stockton Police Department does suspect there is a serial killer at work in our city. This is due to several details that have been shared with us from multiple sources that are trusted, that are independent of each other, and that are inside and outside of law enforcement. So yeah, man, this is real, bro. There's somebody on the loose. They don't know if it's one person. I heard different things, bro. It could be it's multiple people. I heard uh, new like I like I said, bro. I can't just guess, but people are dying randomly. People are getting shot, bro. Randomly, like and I, and I seen people in comments saying, "Oh, it's stacked it. Why y'all? You know what I'm saying they shouldn't trip. Like they used to this. You know what I'm saying gun violence. Like it's stacked him. That's like little Oakland." Like, why y'all tripping? See, it's one thing to be involved in gang violence and shootings or maybe even robberies, you know, be scared to get robbed that night. But to know there's a, a wild man out there just shooting random people at will, killing random people, a psychopath on the loose, my nigga. There is a psychopath on the loose within the city of Stockton, bro. No cap. The Stockton Police Department issued out a warning. You guys know I'm in college, right? The little college I go to issued out a warning. Sent us a memo, a text, and an email saying, do not walk alone. Do not walk with your earbuds in, your headphones in. Be vigil be, be, be aware of your surroundings. You know what I'm saying? Do not walk at night, especially alone. The Stockton Police Department pushed out that memo too. Like, bro, it's real. There's a wild man on the loose, bro. So if you have loved ones in Stockton, if you know someone in Stockton, I suggest you let them know, man, don't be walking alone. It's not, I mean, Stockton is not a safe city as ready as it is. But when there's a motherfucking, but that's because, you know, gangs and motherfuckers is hungry and there's poverty and, you know what I'm saying, motherfuckers is trying to, you know, hit a lick and, you know what I'm saying, that's one thing. Because when motherfuckers go and want to rob somebody, they're not looking to kill you. You know what I'm saying? Nine times out of ten, probably ten times out of ten. You know what I'm saying? When someone tries to rob you, their, their intention is not to kill you, bro. Their intention is just take your, your shit. You know what I'm saying? You give it up. You know what I'm saying? If you don't, you might have a scruffle. And, and nine, times, nine times out of ten, when people do get shot, it's because the robber got scared, got nervous, and pulled the trigger. And that's just facts. Now, this situation, when there's a lunatic on the loose, bro, there is a lunatic on the loose. 
within the city of Stockton shooting at random people, killing random people. And they're precise, too. They're strategic, bro. They're strategic. They're not just, you know what I'm saying? They're, they're smart about it. They're, they're, they're going into places and neighborhoods where they know there's no cameras, where they know there's there's no um, not that much traffic. Five in the morning, six in the morning, a man walks out his house getting ready to go to work. Blah, 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 blah. Gone right there. Front, they had no gang affiliation, no nothing. Random shooting, bro. A girl walking her dog. Blah, 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 blah. Worked a regular job, lived a normal life. Another one, uh, 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 an older Mexican man. He gets gunned down. Like, bro, people are getting gunned down, bro, randomly. And it's all happening in the in the nighttime hours when it gets dark, and when the sun goes down, and, and in places where there's not a lot of traffic. You know what I'm saying? So be careful. Um, what else? What else? I also heard that there's a rumor going around that it, it possibly might be some white folks, some white supremacy shit going on. As you know, Stockton is a, a very diverse city. I believe a couple of years ago, it was voted the most diverse city in America. That's, that's you know what I'm saying? The mo one of the most diverse cities in the whole country. Bro, there's motherfucking Pakistans. There's Native American. There's Mexican, Asians, all types of different Asians. Af uh, blacks, uh, you feel me? White boys, motherfucking Middle Easterns, all kinds of different Middle Easterns, Europeans. Like, you know what I'm saying? There's everything in Stockton, bro. Like, you feel me? And supposedly, there's a rumor going on that it's some white supremacy shit. That's a, it's more than one person that is doing these killings because majority of the killings, I think besides one person, are all minorities. All the people that were shot, the random victims that has been getting shot and killed by these lunatics or lunatic are minorities, people of color. And allegedly, there's a rumor going around, man, that it's some white dudes. On some white supremacy shit. Taking out minorities within the city of Stockton. Now again this is a rumor. But it's a rumor that's going around. Okay for one. The psychopath or psychopaths. Is not a rumor. That shit is real bro. There's somebody or somebody's going around. Killing motherfuckers randomly in Stockton. This ain't no just regular gang shit. Or no you know what I'm saying. No. Retaliation for gang or robberies or nothing like that, bro. This is some random killings and innocent people are being shot and killed. Now, that's not a rumor. The rumor is that it's some skinheads, or I don't even want to put it on skinheads, man. Shout out to the skinheads, but it's some white supremacist motherfuckers. You know what I'm saying? Taking out minorities in Stockton. And that shit ain't cool, bro. Like, um, you know what I'm saying? I just, I don't know. I don't know what, what could you do in this situation because you don't know who it is. You know what I'm saying? When it's gang violence, bro, and someone slides on your family or someone shoots your shit up, like you know who to who to slide back on. You know who to retaliate on. You know what to do. You know, or like if you know what I'm saying, if your family, you if you civilians, and your people want to call the cops. You know what I'm saying? I don't recommend calling the cops on nobody. You know what I'm saying? But if you're a civilian, then that's your right to. You can do that. You know what I'm saying? If you're a civilian, then you know who to call the cops on and, 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 and you feel me, make a police report on. In this situation, you don't know nothing. This dude's dressed in all black, allegedly, uh, killing random innocent people, bro. People of color. Now, I suggest people of color that are watching, if you're in the city of Stockton, the surrounding area, if you have family in this area. Man, now you know why motherfuckers got guns and shit. You know what I'm saying? But uh, just stay alert. Stay aware. Uh, remember the three A's. Remember the three A's. Stay awake, alert, and aware. You know what I'm saying? You got to be awake. You got to be You gotta be on your toes. You know what I'm saying? You got to be aware. You got to be aware of your surroundings. You got to stay on alert. You know what I'm saying? 
Can't let your guard down. Don't be walking at night. Don't even be driving at night, especially the woman. You know what I'm saying? Because these psychopaths are not only, they're not just targeting women, they're targeting men too. But, you know, women are more um, vulnerable. So just stay, man, just stay out the way, way. Try not to walk your dogs when the sun goes down. Because I know a lot of people like to do that. Take their dogs out for a walk when the sun goes down. Let them run around the neighborhood. You know what I'm saying? No, it's not a good time, bro. It's not a good time. There's a motherfucking psychopath, lunatic, crazy motherfucking white boys running around killing people of color, man. You feel me? It ain't cool, man. This motherfucking world. Donald Trump got motherfuckers going crazy. You know what I'm saying? These motherfuckers want their get backs. These niggas want their get backs, bro. You feel me? They want, we gonna run this shit back, nigga. Fuck that. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know what else to say, bro, but just stay safe. Stay alert. If you guys heard about this, let me know in the comments. If you guys think it's real or you guys think it's bullshit, what do you guys think? Because I've done seen so many comments, bro, about different things, about different conspiracies, about some people say, oh, it's a political thing. Like, they're trying to race. It's a, some people are saying it's politicians that are doing the killings, bro. Like, the politicians are raising up the crime rate so they, when the election year comes, they can, like, I'm like, what the fuck? So you think politicians are going out killing random people so the crime rates should go up so they can be like, oh, look, this other politician is soft on crime. Crime has risen drastically during his term in office. You should vote me in office and I'll get crime down. Like, what the fuck? You really think they're going to go to that lane? I mean, I don't know. Maybe so. You know what I'm saying? Like, motherfuckers is crazy, bro. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. Um, I honestly believe that it's a fact that there's a some, either one or more lunatics out there killing people. Let me know what you guys think. Is it just shootings in Stockton where random people happen to just get shot? Because that happens too. Where there's gang violence and shootings and random people... Get shot by stray bullets. Is this one of those situations? Let me know what you guys think in the comments. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. If you want to support the channel even further, there goes the cash app, man. And hit that notification bell as well. You'll get all the notifications on when I drop. It's the kid, and I'm gone.